Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Sprocket video on my channel. Today we are on the railway map, as you guys can see right there. Uh, we have to win the battle. Now, honestly, what I want to do in this video is I want to take one of our tanks that we've previously used, change the gun on the tank to be very minimal, then we're going to go into the files, we're going to edit them a little bit, and we're going to make a 20mm auto cannon. Hopefully, it'll work out, hopefully it'll work well, and uh, hopefully it'll actually look nice. So, let's find ourselves a tank to actually work with, and then we'll see what happens from there. Let's get on with it, shall we? Okay, so this is my Chinese interwar tank. I don't know why I've got this uh, as it stands, but um, I do. So, this is currently a tank that we do currently own. Now, with that being said, we currently have a gun on here that is how big? Uh, cannon, it is currently 20 mil. It is a 20 mil caliber gun. If I shoot that gun... Oh, you know what? It actually doesn't take too long to fire already, but we're going to add an extra loader, and uh, that's going to fire quicker, and hopefully we can win a war with this. Yeah, let's do it. Okie dokie, so now if we load up this tank yet again, we should actually find that uh, we actually have another loader in here, so it should take less time to actually... Oh, has it not worked? I don't think it's worked. No, that's sad. What the heck? Okay, so now I've actually managed to do it. So, it should fire every, like, few seconds now, which is excellent. And uh, we should be able to take this thing into war. All right, excellent. No, this is good. This is brilliant. Uh, we are going to make it so that the guys actually fit in here as well. Because uh, I do believe that does make sense to do. So, if we can go to the turret, uh, we can make the basket bigger. Basket space. Oh, we still can't actually get enough room in there. That's not good. That's really not good, actually. Um, firepower, ammo, everything's in the turret currently. We have 30 and 30. So really, if we do have an extra loader... Oh, but they're tiny rounds. So it still doesn't actually work, does it? Hmm. Hmm, mm, mm. All right, how do we make it so that it, it doesn't look too weird, but we extend it a little bit? So let's go ahead and enter freeform mode. Yes. We're going to go to faces, we're going to grab this one, and we're going to send it backwards, like so. Quite a distance, there we go. Extend it upwards as well. And there we go, we got a long barrel. And we got a long turret, and we fit everything in it. Let's go. Okay, I'm ready. Guys, I'm totally ready. I don't know how much damage this thing's going to be able to do. Probably not very much at all, but we're going to go in and see what we can do with it. Um, yeah. How many tanks do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. We have nine tanks. It actually says in the bottom right, to be fair. Uh, also, wait. No. There's no point in me doing that. There's no point in me driving out with that much ammo. We've got none. We actually legitimately have none. Let's go with 30 of these. Hopefully that doesn't go over by too much. Oh, that's annoying. That's very annoying. Okay, go to base. Grab this one. There we go. <laughs> okay, so that's how you get around it. You just make the turret way bigger. Excellent. Yes. All right, 30 of these as well. See if we can fit those in. Yes, we can. We're still under 10 tons, so I'm actually not too shabbed. Shabbed? Not even a word. Is shabbed a word? I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, that's not too shabby, to be fair. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine? Nine. Nine's over there. All right, excellent. Let's get in there. Let's go to war, guys. Let's go to war. Alright, the enemy seems to have just spawned in. I think all of my tanks are going to get over to the, the... Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. They're going to one-shot me every time, guys. They're going to one-shot me every time. I can't shoot through you. Alright, I'm not going to lie, I don't think any of those are actually going through the enemy. They're not getting through the target, uh, which is is not amazing. Uh, let's continue forwards, and we'll see if we can get closer. If we can then get close, we might be able to still kill them. Maybe. I guess we'll see. Alright, keep going, guys. Attack! Look at this guy. Look at this fully automatic firing from him. I don't think we've killed a single tank yet not good. 
All right, it seems a bit shallower over here, so we're gonna try and get over that way. Uh, that guy's already, already like in there. Oh, we've killed one. Nice. All right, let's get in there. Come on. Oh, 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 jeez. Okay, that was a weird way of getting over, but we are over. Excellent. My engine is currently dying. I didn't edit that at all, apparently. Oh, Sag. Big Sag. All right, we're going to try and get this one close enough to uh, destroy every tank in the enemy fleet. Enemy fleet? Enemy uh, arsenal? I guess it's arsenal. All right, let's go. Come on. Get ourselves over there. Hopefully everybody else is on their way over as well. We don't have a radio, so I can't command everyone over. Uh, and apparently there's only like three enemy tanks. That's weird. But okay. not working out the way that I wanted it to, guys. I can't get through its armor. It's gonna shoot me. Oh, we just took a round, but I'm not dead. Hey, that's good. That's always good. All right. Is everybody else dead? We have three tanks remaining. Okay. So they've killed almost all of my guys, unfortunately, but it's okay. Don't worry. Let's continue around. Let's continue around all the way. Here we go. Try and shoot it in the back of the turret. Let's turn our gun around. Make sure we are ready for it. Try and dodge around. Yeah, we did. Excellent. I'm gonna hide behind this guy. And hopefully that's gonna be A-OK. -okay. Hide. Excellent. Try and kill this one. Okay. I feel like it's almost dead. I'm running out of rounds, though. Hey, there we go. Cromwell dead. Uh-oh, it's starting to move. Trying to take out its track. I'm trying to take out its track. Oh, no. What are you two doing? Unbelievable. So there is only one enemy tank left, but uh, obviously there's an issue with it. It's, uh, its armor's a bit too much for me. I'm not sure we'll be able to get through it at all, but... Uh, we're gonna continue to try, okay? We're gonna continue to try. Let's go. Guys, my engine at the back is is dying. It is dying. Um, obviously that's not good. I don't even know if this thing has an exhaust on it, does it? Oh yeah, the exhausts are there. Does it have any engine vents? I don't think there's any engine vents. Yeah, okay. Well, this thing is um, not the best, but that's okay. We're gonna continue into battle anyway. Let's go, guys, come on. I don't know where the other tank is that's alive, but it's somewhere back there. I feel like what we needed to do was actually build a entire, an entirely new tank um, uh, that, that would be fit for purpose. Also, maybe not start on this map. So, 20 mil armor, uh, oh sorry, 20 mil guns should be able to get through quite a bit of armor. As long as we put the in it in the right place, uh, in time, if that makes sense. So, uh, we'll see what happens here, but... Uh, Oh wait, is that the enemy? That's an enemy as well. Oh, that's not good. I can't aim down. I can't kill it. Kill it, guys! No! Nah. All right, okay. So it's not working out the way that we quite want it to. All right, that's fine. How about we change tank to something else? Um, maybe even this. There we go. And we'll we'll make whatever this gun is. So it is currently a 120 millimeter gun. Let's make that a little bit more automatic. Hmm. Let's do that. One, one, one. Future. Let's do this. Okay, so I would say that this is a little bit cheaty because we don't actually have enough room for all of these people, but let's go ahead and go for it. It reloads. 
I want to say relatively quickly. I don't know what that is. Why is that just happened? I don't know, but let's see how fast this thing can fire. Ready? Yeah, no, this is going to destroy everything. <laughs> this is actually going to destroy literally everything that comes at it. So let's drive ourselves over there. We will ruin anything that happens. Anything that's there. What is that guy? Let's turn towards it. Let's wait a second. It's round did actually hit me, and I, I can't kill it because it's it's hiding. All right, what about you? All right, there we go. That one's dead. Excellent. Let's continue. Oh, one's all the way over there. Hang on one second. My gun takes a little bit of time to, to aim, but that's okay. Oh, way too high. Way too high. They're only showing me their guns. Which I'm not gonna lie, is slightly annoying. Oh, there we go. Excellent. Next. You're next, buddy. You're next. Hey, there we go. And then finally you. Alright, where have you gone? <laughs> where have you gone? I think it fired and then it, it slid down the hill because it fired. That's, uh, I believe what happened there. Is there two there? I think that might be two tanks there. Oh, I missed. I missed again. Oh. Hey, there we go. All right, the automatic fire is, uh, I want to say a good tool, you know. Especially on a 120 millimeter gun. That's, uh, that's pretty crazy. All right, let's get over there. Come on. I love this tank, by the way. I think the tank design on this one's actually pretty cool. It is very cool. Let's get over there, guys. All right, it is going to shoot at me. It missed. Hey! We shot it on the run. That is insane. That is actually insane. Nice. All right, cool. So we know that it does work. Uh, obviously, with bigger rounds, obviously, we need more loaders, but that's okay. Uh, and yes, it does actually work out for us, which is excellent. I think I'm going to try and build a tank from the ground up, uh, and we'll try and do it that way next time. So, um, yeah, if you guys want to see that, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And, uh, yeah, we'll try and build something cool next time. But anyway, for now, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.